So we got a Valentine's Day PR box from Kim Chishik Beauty. It's uh, all lip products actually. So if you guys are interested, I'm going to be using most of them and a little bit of everything and you'll see what I got. I'll show you guys. And we're going to be doing a full face on Kim Chishik Beauty, of course. If you guys don't know me, welcome. I'm Elena. I usually do makeup tutorials, reviews, uh, drag looks like this, <laughs> and celebrity impersonations, all kind of stuff. In this video, obviously, we're doing this kind of look and subscribe, like, comment, and follow me on social media. All the links are down below. So let's get right into this. So first of all, I want to thank Kim Chi Shik Beauty. Thank you so much, you guys, for sending me another PR box. This is pretty much like thank you uh, for being on the team and happy Valentine's Day from Kim Chi. And uh, we can't wait to see what you create. So that's what I created. Drag, of course. Duh. And I haven't done drag look on my channel. Sorry, guys. If you're waiting for a Friday to start drag, oh, I've been busy. I've been busy with a, a lot of studying. I signed up for some trainings not related to makeup. I'm in my fitness career. Back to it. Zumba, Les Mills, Body Combat. I've been studying. There's so much studying. So I'm like... I'm a little overwhelmed right now, so I haven't been doing it, but like I'm feeling my oats right now. Anyway, so here's the PR box, and I took them out of the boxes, a little cartons already, but here are the lip products. A lot of stuff they received they already at home, like similar things, like I know their formula, butter, marshmallow, lipsticks, lipis, this lipis, butter lipis, they're so good, soft, 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 and creamy. Maybe just a little too creamy for my taste, but they're good for like most normal people. <laughs> I just like matte better, but it's just my preference. But they're real soft. And we received, we, me. So I, I received like three colors here. The neutral, wowza, and <clears throat> the real light one. I haven't tried yet. And this is Cafe Alate. And this one is really pretty. I put it right in the middle and put shimmer on top. But this one is so, so pretty. I like, I'm totally into this kind of neutrals. Look how pretty this is, if you can see. I just put self tanner on, so excuse the brown. I still have to wash it off, you know, one of those mousse things. I haven't washed it off yet. <laughs> so it might be a little too brown now. And my face is a little too light compared. But whatever. Anyway, so these colors and the bright one that I'm wearing, and this one is M B uh, Y G J. I think I googled what Y G J means, but I don't remember already. <laughs> it's kind of a reddish but a cool tone red. It's really pretty too. And we got two lipsticks. One neutral, which like I love this. You know, I love neutrals better than this kind of thing. This is exposed. And this is the date night. And the date night, I already had this before. It's amazing, amazing. The bomb. This red is like true red. I don't know if you want to see this watch. I'm going to show you this watch if you haven't seen it yet. But the date night is the tits. And this is a matte. I love matte lipstick formula from Kimchi. This is like true red. There's no warmth. There's no cool. It's like a perfect shade of red. Just like perfect red. I love it. So, and I don't even like red in general. So these, and then I got a few lip liners here. Just like a variety of shades here. There's some pinks, there's some neutrals, and stuff like that. So um, the light one is really pretty and neutral. This is right up my alley. I used the bright one today. This was the perfect match for the lipstick. And this one is Beat, Beat Ray, Better Rave. Something like that, but there you go. So we got the lip liners and we got the three products that I haven't personally used yet and I haven't gotten them from Kimchi before. And this is a lip oil. And this one, I mean, I'm not going to sample it for you because you won't be able to see it, but it smells almost like floral, I would say. I can't quite place it, but it's so pleasant. I love it. It's so, so good. I'm not sure what kind of scent it is. It's not very overwhelming, but I love scented stuff. So I'm like, mm, love it. And we got the treatment, which I haven't used yet. So this looks like this. Let's sniff it together. Candy Lips Lip Mask. It's a lip mask, actually. Mmm, this is minty. Oh, this is so good. I'm so using this overnight tonight. 
Mm. For some reason, I'm salivating. I'm hungry. We haven't had dinner yet. I want to eat that treatment. <laughs> My husband's sitting here. He's hungry too. You want some treatment? He's like, mm. <laughs> and we got the lip scrub, which I can't find already. I put it away somewhere, but let me see. Where did I do it? Oh, here we go. This is a lip scrub, and this one is like a similar scent, very minty. And I used it like off camera, but it really makes your lips smooth. Love, love, love this stuff. So, yeah, I'm really impressed with this. So, we're gonna be using most of the kimchi makeup that I already have. You can see some of my kimchi stuff here and here with Hello Kitty. That's not kimchi related. I just love Hello Kitty. And I've got a kimchi fan. And that's it. So you'll see most of it is going to be voiceover because it's a lot. It's a full face and the gems are from kimchi as well. Uh, the eyebrows are not. It's Anastasia Beverly Hills, but everything else is kimchi. So enjoy and leave me a comment below and use Elena Glam discount code for 15% off on Kimchi Shake Squad. And this is PR. This is a gifted just a disclaimer. And I get some commission from Kimchi Shake Beauty if you use my code. So thank you for using, guys. Uh, I've been getting some commissions every few months. So it's not a lot, but it's, it's nice to have some. So thank you so much for using it. So without further ado, let's get to the rest of the video. I decided to go with a very vampy Valentine's Day look and like a pink and red. I'm kind of wearing something pink underneath here, but this might change, but I think I was feeling pink. And we're using two palettes pretty much, well, two and a half holy shards. This one, and this is so effing bright, of course, it's beautiful, and it has all the reds, like a deep reds and pinks. And I'm gonna use a little bit of this because it has glitter in it. And this is Strawberries and Cream, the Donut Collection. Looks like this. Yeah, I don't think I did that tutorial with this one. Uh, I might have switched it, I don't remember. But anyway, so let's get into it so i drew my eyebrows way about my own because when i do like a kimchi inspired i don't know kimchi looks for kimchi shake brand i feel like i want to do extra because kimchi eyebrows are usually over here i'm not doing kimchi makeup but something like you know in her uh in her world right so we're gonna do the brights so i'm gonna use pretty much i'm not gonna lift it anymore this one and this 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 all the reds a little bit of orange to get more red going and that's it for this palette and then maybe like a little bit of this shimmer and then the other one can be for glitter mostly in the white because the other one has white and when i said two and a half this is the half i'm talking about so this is going to be black from here the pretty much bold black this one looks purple but it's just kind of like um it gives a little purple, but when you put it on, it looks black. So they're pretty much, to me, they're interchangeable. So let's get into it. So I'm going to use the big A brush, B, big ass brush, pretty much. And this is Morphe because this is so blown out. So we're going to go with big one, Mercury and Retrograde. This is the deepest shade. And I used, oh, already made a boob. Anyway, I used the Kimchi Concealer as a base. My fingers are dirty, of course, and I'm making a mess, but... It'll work. This is drag, it has to be messy, right? So as I said, this one is very, very deep, but it's more pink and we're gonna create more of a orangey, reddish tone on the outside. This is why I like to do eyes first, even with the drag makeup looks, cause you can clean up later. And I don't care how messy it's gonna go. So I'm going to clean this brush on a color switch and add a little more of a brighter Mars, like a lighter red here. So like I always say in my videos, when you do reds and apply it on a light, light base, they always gonna come off pink because white plus red gives pink. And we need to add orange for that reason. I'm gonna use another brush. I'm gonna go for the Comet. And this is a true orange, like a true orange. But when you add it, it's gonna come off as more red. And this doesn't matter, I'll clean it. 
I kind of started late today, to be honest. That's why I'm kind of going like very fast and messy. Cats happened as usual. Cats and Zumba. I taught Zumba this morning and then I stayed to practice the new choreo. And then I came home. Alan wanted to suck. As you might know, I have three cats and one of them a two-year-old. He's going to be two in April. And he loves to suck my shirt like nurse and he's still like a baby pretty much so he always has to be a baby so he lays on me he starts sucking and then nothing gets done <laughs> but i had a little more concealer it might not be a little too even here so the eyebrows are done in abh pencil brow with in the blonde color and this is like a sketch, so I have something to go with, but you know, we're gonna draw all the magic and the hairs later. So I'm gonna use this palette for the white, because it has a white in it. I think it's the only one that I've seen with a white, with Kimchi brand. And this is a darn good white, real good. Look how pigmented. See, this is what I was expecting from Kimchi, and this is what we got from Kimchi. White is real white. I'm just stamping it on. We're gonna blend it. Anyway, so cats happen and nothing gets done until later. And then I'm like, I'm in a rush. I still want to film, but <laughs> it's getting late. So I'm like, let me just blend it with a big brush. <laughs> if you have cats, comment below. They probably always mess up your schedule. If the cat is on your lap, you can't do nothing. It's the law. Cat owns you pretty much. And I have three of them, so can you imagine? So it's pretty much uh, initial blend. And I'm gonna do some blendy blendy under the eye in the same matter. I'm just gonna pinch this brush because I don't feel like getting another brush. And I'm gonna clean up under eye anyway. So let's get the black from this little sucker and pack it on. Usually I start with black, but I've been into adding black afterwards because sometimes black gets out of control and takes way too much space and then it's hard to add more color all you see is black so i kind of want to add black in the small amounts adding shimmers first so i already put some base on the same concealer and we're gonna use pinks i'm pretty much using the old rainbow shards palette right now I'm gonna do the glitters from the other palette. I love halo eye looks. They're like a little messy, a little dramatic. I think they're great for drag. So I'm gonna clean up the brush. I'm gonna go with a lighter shade from the strawberry palette. This and maybe a little bit of this. And those are kind of a base for the glitter. And then I'm gonna be glitter in the middle. Cause I feel like I love glitter and halo eyes. Uh, glitter or rhinestone or both. I might add some gems later. I still have these. The red ones from the the red palette, which I'm not using, but I'm gonna use gems from it. Why not? Right. You can mix and match. All right, so let's do the glitter. So the glitter I applied with the finger and then I applied with the brush both. And I think I'm gonna go with the brush in this case because my fingers kind of get messy. So I'm gonna go with the lighter shade, the ones I showed you earlier. And usually kimchi formula is very good with no base and kind of goes on anyway. It's very smooth. This one is a little more flaky than other palettes I have. It's like a little bigger flakes, I think, but it gives it a little more sparkle too. So the eyes are pretty much done. I'm going to put the rest of it on voiceover because my husband making noise in the kitchen. He just came back from Walmart, putting stuff away, <laughs> long story. And besides, it's like, it's basic. All the products, probably almost all of them are gonna be Kim Kimchi Shake Beauty, of course. So I'm gonna start with moisturizing primer, hydrating primer, and the rest is the voiceover. Now we're using foundation, the Kimchi Real Good Foundation, 110L and 120M mixed together to kind of uh, go with my soft tanner as much as I can. I clearly need to shower. 
uh i bh counter stick so that's the only thing that are not kimchi it's a color mink and this one is a real cool tone nice for contour just a basic drag hunter or even hand drag kimchi shake the most concealer in medium beige and the white one for the highlight and conceal and just a basic triangle or diamond kind of shape a real highlight everything and here's mimi are you showing your butthole to everyone are you happy with yourself mimi and now we're gonna counter with kim chishi counter and this is zero three chocolate in taylor bronzer i went to miami my usual uh the only counter i have the lighter counter is tony Tony, uh, I usually use on the nose because it's a lighter shade. Uh, blend this all in and add a little bit more pink for the contour to kind of blend with the eye makeup and make it more vampy. Taylor brush, Mercedes, my go to, the bright color, it kind of goes together with uh, the makeup look because there is orange and pink, I'm mixing them together. And now we're going with Kimchi and Trixie collab highlighter and going with a, I think it's a Trixie side I'm not sure uh, a real good mascara and this is a very nice mascara it doesn't have to be perfect because eyelashes are gonna go on and I use that bish eyelashes and this is the lip liner and this is the one I received in PR actually and the color is a perfect match for the marshmallow butter lip I'm gonna use it's like a reddish uh, cool tone YGL. This is the lipstick. There you go. And the lighter tone in the middle is that neutral light cafe au lait. And I packed it in the middle. So the makeup look is done. You saw most of it on camera and some of it off camera. And I used, managed to use all of the kimchi products except for Anastasia Beverly Hills uh, contour stick. And there was something else, right? No, I think the rest was kimchi. And the lipsticks, obviously, is from the new PR box I received. It was kind of more of a thank you for, you know, and happy Valentine's Day from kimchi. And the new product that I did find new to me was the lip scrub and the lip mask and the lip oil. So those I have not used before. They all smell amazing, by the way. The lip oil is very refreshing and... As you might know, if you know me from my previous videos, I always say I hate putting stuff on my lips like balms and oils. I feel the, you know, I, I know it's probably good for you, but I don't like it. But this is so pleasant, I might use it actually. I might make myself use it. And the lip scrub is very pleasant, and my lips are so soft, so lush. I loved it. So thank you, Kimchi. Thank you, Kimchi staff. It's beautiful, and yeah, I loved everything I received and here's the look with all the king g products and kind of a late valentine's day look and i did use cards from the red palette thingy one of these thingies here and the hearts already put them back anyway there you go a very valentine uh drag look <laughs> So let me know what you guys think. Leave me a comment below. Do you own any of these? The scrub and the oil. Do you like lip oils? Do you like lip masks? I do like masks, but I don't like oils for some reason. Maybe I'll get into it. So don't forget to use Elena Glam for 15% off. It's my discount code with Kim Jishik Beauty. It's going to be listed below as usual. If you like something that you see, again, it gets small commission. And let me know how you like these products. Do you own any lip scrubs? Kim Chi lip scrub? Do you have the a lip mask i haven't tried it yet i only tried these two things and my lips felt so lush uh, i loved it to be honest so even though i don't like lip oil i like this thing so leave me a comment like this video if you enjoyed it and do subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet and ring the notification bell so you get notified of all new videos I upload so thank you all for watching i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video bye